Today, let's talk about Apple's latest display technology, which they use in their iPad Pro M4. And yes, I'm talking about Tandem OLED. We all know that Samsung makes OLED panels, and in fact, LG makes too. But why Apple use Tandem OLED? What exactly Tandem OLED is? Is it better than the normal OLED, or it is better than the Mini LEDs, or uh, is it worth to use? We're gonna find in today's video. So make sure you watch this video till the end. So let's understand what exactly is Tandem OLED. So basically, it is nothing but two stacked OLED panels on each other. Yes, double the OLED panels, double the fun. This isn't about just cranking up the resolution, but this technique for sure improves the efficiency of the display, the brightness and the contrast. Unlike LCD or Mini LED display, OLED panels does not require backlight. Instead, they have a thin film of organic material deposit on glass or plastic substrate. When current passes through substrate, the organic material glow and light up pixels. This dual stack combination of OLED achieves 1000 nits full screen brightness on HDR and HDR content and it goes up to 16000 nits peak brightness on iPad Pro M4. And my personal suggestion is that you don't watch Open IMA on this iPad because you might go blind. Just you know bad joke i know anyways now let's talk about what are the benefits of tandem oled first of course comes to the mind is brightness just like i mentioned that the ipad pro m4 has the full screen brightness of 1000 nits while watching sdr and hdr content and it can goes up to 16000 nits peak while watching hdr content so tandem oled for sure increases the intensity of brightness while you're watching content or doing your work next comes the contrast so by nature itself oled panels are very contrasty and gives you a very punchy color but here tandem oled has two stacked upon each other and that is the reason the contrast goes to next level and with the introduction of m4 chip in ipad pro m4 you get 2 million is to 1 contrast ratio. So I would recommend that you watch our videos on Tandem OLED. I know, again. Not only contrast, but the Tandem OLED also offers you amazing colors and viewing angles because they are using two different OLED panels into one. Hence, double the brightness. Hence, better viewing angle. You may not notice this, but when you do in the direct sunlight or in very lit up environment, you will gonna appreciate this boon. Tandem OLED utilizes the powerful combination of physics and material science to transition between on and off state to achieve exponential sub millisecond control over the color and luminance of individual pixel. This result into less motion blur while watching movies, playing games or just scrolling, you know. And not only that, Tandem OLED will increase the lifespan of your display. Due to its double stack nature, the Tandem OLED will last four times longer than the normal OLED, which means you can use your iPad Pro M4 for a decade and more. So now let's talk about is Tandem OLED is actually better than the traditional OLED or not. The benefits of Tandem OLED are numerous. It provides amazing brightness level and it surpasses any tablet in the market right now and giving you the amazing viewing experience on the display. The regular OLED panels have one major issue and that is the brightness level. They do not offer amazing brightness level. Hence, we tend to use the display maxing out the brightness because of which there is a possibility that display might develop burden issue and will reduce display longevity. And you know what Apple is very smart. What they did with Tandem OLED is that they divided the workload into two different panels, hence maxing out the efficiency and brightness and reducing the burn-in risk. But, but, but this Tandem OLED is not all sunshine and rainbows because there is one con which comes with every new technology and that is the cost production cost. Right now it is very costly to produce. But with time as the technology matures, I assure you guys that this Tandem OLED will become more staple in Apple's catalog and other device manufacturers will also follow Apple's footstep, you know, like they always do. And lastly, there is one more thing which I need to tell you guys and that is the combination of M4 and Tandem OLED is powerful. Well, iPad Pro 2024 does not come only with Tandem OLED. It also has M4 chip first time ever introduced in iPad, of course, and that is based on second generation of three nanometer architecture, which means that the chip itself has been polished and because of which the calibration of display is mind blowing because in M4 you get a new display engine, which produce precise color and amazingly high level of sustained brightness, ensuring that the new iPad Pro is more than capable of supporting tasks that rely on color calibration or color correction. 
Okay, now let's conclude the video. So the introduction of tandem OLED display marks a significant milestone for Apple, of course, and for the display market as a whole. So it's an exciting time to be in the technology world and you never know what Apple holds for us in the next month because you know what? Next month is WWDC. But if you want to know about another display technology which they use in their iPad Pro and that is of course nano texture display class, I have made a dedicated video and I'll give you the link over here in the iCard section. Make sure you watch it. And if you like this video, then press the like button and let YouTube know that we are doing some good work. And of course, subscribe to IGV and press the bell icon so that you get notified each and every time we post a video. And do let me know in the comment section which is your favorite display tech. Mine is of course the AMOLED because it uh, gets the job done. And for now, Tandem OLED is a bit too pricey in my opinion. What are yours? Do let me know. And on this note, this is me Samir signing off and I will see you in the next one. Till then, tada, see ya, bye bye guys.